Finding more in PubMed using Google Scholar. This tutorial is brought to you by Lister Hill Library of the Health Sciences at the University of Alabama at Birmingham. Before we go into Google Scholar, let's quickly review how PubMed searches for articles. PubMed searches for your search terms within the title, abstract, and subject headings or MeSH term of article records. Unless your search terms appear in one of these fields, you will miss articles that mention the terms only in their full text. This is where Google Scholar can be a great resource. Among other sites, Google Scholar searches PubMed, and it searches PubMed in a much broader way than when you search PubMed directly. Google Scholar searches the full text of articles in PubMed, not just the article's title, abstract, and subject headings. Therefore, it's possible to find more PubMed articles that mention a specific term in their full text than if you search PubMed directly. In this way, using Google Scholar is one way you can expand your PubMed search. Let's do a sample search so we can see how this works. Let's say you're trying to find articles that use or discuss the Mayo Portland Adaptability Inventory 3, a rating scale used to measure functional ability, often among traumatic brain injury patients. For any titles that look interesting, you can click the versions link below the citation to see all available versions or sources of the citation. Let's click to view all three versions of this one, Evaluation of Patients with Mild Traumatic Brain Injury. This will show us all the different sites Google Scholar found that index this particular article. We can look at the URL in green just below the title to see what site each version is from. Here's one version on a journal's website. Here's another version on a website that indexes the collection of the Institute for Scientific and Technical Information of the French National Center for Scientific Research. Remember though, we're looking for a version that is in PubMed. This one is from the National Center for Biotechnology Information within the National Institutes of Health. Results from this URL are probably from PubMed, so let's click on this one. We're taken into PubMed where we can do a couple of things to find more articles on the same or similar topic. We can view related citations. We can also click the plus sign next to MeSH terms at the bottom of the abstract. This allows us to see what medical subject headings have been assigned to this article. You may get additional search term ideas here that you had not thought of before. You should also note that the name of the rating scale we searched for in Google Scholar, the Mayo Portland Adaptability Inventory 3, is not mentioned anywhere in the title, abstract, or list of MeSH terms. Therefore, if we had done the same search directly in PubMed, we would not have found this article, which does discuss the Mayo Portland scale in decent detail. We can click the UAB article linker button to see what full text options are available through the library. If you don't see the article linker button, you can copy the unique number for the article, the PMID number, and paste it into a PubMed search box on the library's homepage. This allows PubMed to recognize you as a UAB user and will cause the article linker button to appear. Want to learn more about Google Scholar? Visit this LHL guide for more tips and tricks. And don't forget to ask a Lister Hill librarian if you need help.